This, though, has health experts calling for more people to get vaccinated and boosted to protect themselves against all variants. Yeah, they say it's your best shot. We're taking, we're talking to a local expert this morning about the possibility of annual booster shots, kind of like the flu shot. ABC Action News reporter Larissa Scott joined us live now in Hillsborough County at a vaccination site with more on what we can expect next. Good morning, Larissa. Hi, good morning, Dia. As COVID-19 cases begin to rise across the U.S. once again, doctors say COVID-19 vaccines and booster shots are our best way to stay protected right now. The big thing we want to do at this point is don't let Omicron become Delta. That's researchers biggest concern. Delta is still the dominant COVID-19 variant in the U.S., but they worry Omicron will be even more contagious and spread quickly. At least 16 states have now reported at least one case of the Omicron variant, and scientists say more will follow. Don't let it do the damage that Delta did. Get those vaccination rates high, get those antibody rates high, and prevent that kind of thing from going on. That's the only way we're going to return to a sense of Normalcy. Health officials are now pushing people to get their booster shots as soon as possible for fears of waning immunity. And so the higher the amount of antibody that you have, the less likely you're going to have a breakthrough case, the, more, the faster you're going to clear any type of infection, and then you're not going to spread it. As a reminder, the CDC just strengthened its recommendations on COVID-19 vaccine boosters. Officials are encouraging everyone 18 and older to get a booster, whether it's six months after their Pfizer or Moderna two-dose series, or if it's been two months after their Johnson & Johnson shot. Researchers say the coronavirus is tricky because typically antibodies decrease significantly over time, which means regular COVID-19 shots could be in our future to keep mutations at bay. It's very likely coronaviruses are going to become endemic and this is going to become a thing. We kind of talk about how we have to do a flu shot every year. Well, the companies have already put patents in to actually do a flu and COVID combined. And so you can imagine where in the future we may be doing a booster shot once a year for both viruses. The U.S. is more equipped now than ever before to deal with Omicron. Scientists are doing everything they can to learn more about the strain. And even if it's able to circumvent some of our current interventions, experts say we have all the tools to find new ways to fight it. There's one concern with Omicron that the monoclonal antibody treatments won't work because the antibody is, has shifted. But the companies will be able to change that monoclonal antibody and produce a product so that the science can move as fast as the virus is moving is, is pretty impressive. And we have a full list of COVID-19 vaccination sites for you on our website at abcactionnews.com. Just check out our coronavirus section. I'm live in Tampa this morning. Larissa Scott, ABC Action News.